Hey YouTube, it's your boy Kiwai coming at you. Uh, this is actually my second channel. The first one I deleted yesterday night because I thought that the username was kind of long and fucking lame. It was like Aya Kiwai, that Chinese guy or something. It was like really long and like useless. So I made a new one. There you go. It's your boy Kiwai. Simple. So. Uh, to be honest, like I got no fucking talent in doing rapping or singing or like playing an instrument or I'm neither a fucking makeup guru. So the only thing that I can probably do on YouTube is like showing you guys what I'm wearing on a regular basis. Since everybody's been doing the fit of the day, I figure I'll do mine too. So there you go. First off, I got the I got this hat right here. It's actually a Tisa snapback that I ordered from uh, Tass Arnold's official website, uh, Tisa TisaVision.com. Link below. And this is actually a vintage Orlando Magic snapback. So a uh, funny thing is that way back then, I got the I got a uh, fake Tisa snapback. And like I know that a lot of people are rocking the fake ones and like basically there is no big difference between both the only thing is probably like the real one the, T the Tisa are stitched on the uh, original tags and the fake one the stitch the Tisa is stitched under and uh, as for the t-shirt normal uh, lucky seven t-shirt uh, Lucky Seven is actually a Canadian company, so I don't know if you get if you can get those at the U.S. But this is a uh, normal Lucky Seven blue T-shirt, just to complement the uh, little bit of blue that I have on the uh, Orlando Magic snapbacks. As for the uh, necklace, I got the uh, Goodwood piece, a teeth. Uh, I actually start wearing. Good with necklace because like I saw it on Tim's video like on his main channel like Timothy did I get all two or actually on Tim's bakery like Tim wear a lot of uh, good with necklace and I saw it and I thought it was fly so I purchased two I got this one and I got the uh, Jesus piece that a lot of people have too as for the uh, belt I got a uh, Louis Vuitton belt that Purchased from the uh, Louis Vuitton store located in uh, downtown Montreal. So, if you can't afford yourself a Louis Vuitton belt, just buy yourself a normal dark belt or brown belt, and you and you're good to go. Uh, for the jeans, I got a, a pair of Levi's. Those jeans are actually for like bikers. As you can see right here. There's like a flashy things. For bikers when they uh, ride bikes at night so like the uh, other uh, drivers can see them as for the kicks I got the uh, I got the uh, Jordan 617 23 but actually like my girlfriend got this for me for, for as a Christmas present so it's the uh, Jordan 617 23 that just came out this April, earlier April, with the Jordan Jumpman. And this is very cool because like, I live in uh, Montreal, Quebec. Shout out to my 514 people, 450. Anyways, I got myself a, uh... yesterday was like minus 28 or something, so, so it's pretty cold, so you always need to get yourself a jacket for winter. So I have purchased a uh, PGS jacket. I guess I like this little thingy over there. That's totally useless. Do it like this, but I don't know, I just thought it was flying. But actually like, if you don't have the money to uh, to uh, buy yourself a PGS jacket, like a power jumper or whatever you call it, just buy yourself a normal North Face. North Face are like really 
like really warm too, like North Face or like Canada Goose, or you can buy yourself a jacket at Foot Locker for like 100 bucks. Anyways, it's up to you. So yeah, that's it, fit of the day. That's my fit. Thanks for watching guys, and uh, I'm out. Peace.